everyone, this is Hacker Inc. I'm just making a video. Um, okay. Yeah, it's about Google Chrome. It may say mobile at the top, but just trust me, it's Google Chrome. Alright, you see it's built. Hold up. Look down here. Built with Sue Studio. I repeat, boot, be, I'm sorry, built. Built with Sue's Studio. Seriously, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, so Google Chrome built with the new studio. I can't believe they took the new boy out. I got this ISO actually from a CD from a Linux magazine that um said it had a beta of Google Chrome on it or something like that. I can't remember really. As you can see, Google Chrome is supposed to have a very fast boot up. It's not very fast. Oh, oh it just flashed. Okay, when it boots up, it gives you a very nice sound, and it's actually still booting up. This boot up kind of reminds me of Windows Vista. It takes forever. And you see the mouse right here. You don't see anything else. That also... Oops, the mouse disappeared. But that's also remind me of a Windows Vista login, because when, when you logged in, it just went to black, and all you saw, saw was the mouse for a couple seconds, and then it loaded up everything. Oh, here we go. Alright, so as you see here, it's just a desktop of Google Chrome, and then boom. It loads up a full screen application. That is the Google Chrome web browser. None of that fancy stuff that they showed you before was Google Chrome. This is Google Chrome. You know, I mean, this is just a. Uh, Seriously, Google. All I have to say is kind of just a. Come on. I mean, the least you could do is make the mouse like a the Google Chrome logo or something. Make it look better. Make it nicer. And don't use Sue Studio. Is all I have to say. Well, this has been Hacker Inc. with your review of Google Chrome, an ISO I got from a Linux magazine, and you're welcome.